have to realize that this is a losing game. Drug dealers don't have pensions. They don't end up with retirement funds. Who was Felix Mitchell, Oakland's number one hustler? Felix Wayne Mitchell Jr. was a drug lord from Oakland, California and leader of the 69 Mob, criminal organization which operated throughout California and into the Midwest. He was known as Felix the Cat after the cartoon character. His drug businesses was incredibly successful and it was estimated that Mitchell was earning anywhere between $400,000 and $1 million per month with his drug world. Felix Mitchell lived lavishly, enjoying parties, buying expensive cars and purchasing fancy clothing. Additionally, he shared his income with local youth and community programs. Consequently, Mitchell quickly became a local folk hero. Mitchell was born in Oakland and lived in the 69th Avenue St. Antonio Village Housing Project. After dropping out of high school, Mitchell created a criminal organization called My Other Brother or 69 Mob aka Mob connected with the LA Kingpin to the Rees. He made a business complex in the Bay Area, Los Angeles and Detroit. For more than a decade, Mitchell battled competition from the Kim Moss crime family and the Funky Town USA gang to gain total control of the heroin market before 1984-1985 and the widespread practice of the free basin cocaine heroin use was more common. It estimated that Mitchell brought as much as $5 million annually. Mitchell was targeted by the local and federal law enforcement. He was convicted in 1985 and sentenced to life in prison at the Leavenworth Federal Penitentiary, where he was federally stabbed on August 21, 1986, two days before his 32th birthday. And little more than a year later, Mitchell's funeral gained national attention as an example of the impact of drugs culture was having on the country's youth. Thousands of people lined the streets to pay their respects as the funeral procession went through Mitchell's old Oakland neighborhood. His body was carried through crowded streets by a horse-drawn carriage trailed by 14 Rolls Royce limousines and was attended by Black Panther Party co-founder U.O.P. Newton. According to an interview, Bay Area radio personality Jimmy Guy, I remember his funeral. It, it was like Martin Luther King had died and the coverage went out all over the country. I didn't want my city to just be known for honoring the drug lord. The service received news coverage internationally. Onlookers lined the streets to watch the procession. The procession began at Mitchell's former residence, the San Antonio Village, and the, ended at the Star Battle this church at the San Pablo and Stanford Avenues in Oakland. Many civic leaders and citizens were appalled that the service were allowed to take place at all. Proper permits for the event had been filled. In 1987, Mitchell's conviction was overturned because he had died before an appeal could be heard. Criminologists named an effect after him known as Felix Mitchell Paradox where he a major successful police operation. Like the arrest of Mitchell, crime and violence both went up instead of down. As one might expect, it is true that Felix had such monopoly power in parts of Oakland that he controlled pricing and policy the finance of smaller gangs. When he was arrested, it left a power vacuum and the smaller gangs started both price, wars and shootings, wars to fill the void. Mitchell was estimated to have a net worth of $50 million. He had made his fortune through drug trafficking and money laundering. He was also known for his philanthropic activities, donating money to various charities and organizations.